good morning good afternoon good evening depending on your time and depending on when you're going to be seeing this video it's about your boy cost reps corner like i always tell you guys it's my corner it's your corner and it's a corner in today's video i want to show you something i saw Sometimes when I tell you that sometimes some of these men of God we 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 have are really really doing well. Some persons would think maybe I just want to talk about pastors. No. Some of these pastors are very okay in all they do. So when they do good, you as I said, you are castigating them when they do evil. When they do good, you castigate them to talk about it. Um Apostle Professor Johnson Suleiman of the of OPM, Omega Fire Ministry met his childhood friend in a sunday service let me tell you something it is one thing for you to do good it's another thing for the person who you did that good for to remember you it's also another thing for that friend who sees you as a friend to say yes i ate his mother's food the mother took care of me the father took care of me i slept in his mother's house i slept in his father's house and yet the person, no matter his influence state, still comes out to say it that yes, this particular person's mother took care of me, fed me, even clothed me, even sheltered me. That was just what happened. When he saw this particular man, he was very surprised. I have not seen you for a long time. And they started talking. He started asking, Where have you been? What do you do for a living? And the man told him everything. Do you know what Pastor, uh, Apostle Justin Suleiman did? Apostle Justin Suleiman blessed the man. I will know. I did not just come to talk much. I just want us to see the video, so that you see that yes, if paraventure they do the wrong thing, as you castigate them, when they do the right thing, also castigate them too, so that you you will just be free, not castigating some part and leaving some part. Okay, that's what I've come to share. With us. I want to thank all of us for always watching my content. Thank you so much for your love and the care. For those of us who have not subscribed, please I beg you subscribe to the channel, like, comment, and share so we can move this ministry to the set, Okay, take come away next time till you see me on your screen, guys. I leave us with this video of our Apostle Justin Suleiman blessed his childhood friend. Watch with me. But just know that you are a cow now already. Just know that. Matthew. Uh -uh. Where have you been? This is my childhood friend. Stand up. Where have you been? You have been here since last Saturday. You still get chest to. It used to carry weight a lot. When last, when last did I see you? Sir? Like how long ago? When will you see last? Is it TV road or something? A Kenwan road. He. Matu. How many years ago? How many years ago? Eh? How many years ago? Yeah, almost 30 years. 30 years. What are you, what are you doing? Couple mic for my friend Mouth. I retired. You retired as what? I retired as a sport my taekwondo kickboxer, as a uh, down three black, uh, black belt three down holder. You are three black belt holder. Holder, and a taekwondo kickboxer. Yeah. Me address for. <laughs> I have one black. He has three. We grew up together. I just saw the face. I like. It's long. Is that your brother's name? Again? Oh, say amen. Yes, sir. Oh, Lord. Hi. So, what are you doing now? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No, stand up, guys. Stop that. You are, you are my guy. <laughs> Stop that. <laughs> I remember I used to go to their house. So I think when my dad was. That was when my dad, the first time. What happened? I, I can testify when you heal your dad. Your dad said, No, you should go away. That is a Muslim. Both of us went to UBTA together. Then I, I prayed for him. him. Yes, you hid him on the bed. He said, ah, I'm a Muslim. He didn't believe and he was healed. I can still remember that. So I, I will never forget. <laughs> ha! So why have you not seen me since? Why have you. 
this house is so very difficult for me. Things have been difficult. Why have you not come to see me since? What do you want? I used to sleep in his room. I used to sleep in his room before. I used to sleep. Sometimes, when, when people have been of help to you, and you suddenly remember, don't worry. Just know that your life has changed today. You yeah, my friend. Stand up. Matthew, stand. Matthew, stand up. When my father was not well, he used to follow me then to the hospital. My dad, that was how my dad's encounter with Jesus started. So in case you see him now a believer, that was how he started and all that. We used to go together. Sometimes I'll go to his house. Go to my dad sleep there. You know, they don't let you sleep in the hospital. And their house is close to the hospitals. So sleep in the house. We'll go to the hospital together. The mom we cook, we we'll eat. I don't want to see these people, all of them are with. They want to hear what we papa do for him. This one is my friend. But just know that everything has changed. Do you have a car? Do you have a car? Have a car. You don't have a car? No, I don't have a car, sir. Okay. Don't worry, okay? Don't worry. Things are going to change. You can drive. You can drive? Very well. So everything, we are going to t I'm going to see you after the service, okay? For a few minutes. That will talk. But just know that you are a cow now already. Just know that. 